Hello everyone, welcome to Matt's Top Tech. We've got a bit of a different video today. We're going to be showing you how to remove the condensate tray or the drip tray on your fridge freezer. I've had a look online, there's not much out there about this and some people do really struggle to, to empty these. If you've ever noticed some strange smells in your kitchen, around your fridge or your freezer, around the back of them you've got what you call the drip traits where all the condensation off the back of your fridge, it'll, it'll run down the back of the fridge and then it'll go into this drip tray. And the idea is that the, the heat from the compressor evaporates the moisture that goes in there but because moisture can come out of the foods and whatever else you've got in your fridge, um, like spilt milk and stuff like that, when it drips down the back, it can get mouldy and get flies in it, and it, well, it can become really nasty. So all you need to do is just pull your fridge freezer out, and at the back you'll notice there's, there's a tray, chances are it's all mouldy, and it's got some um, foul-smelling liquid in there. So I'm just going to quickly show you how to, to take it out because some people don't know that you can actually take these out on most modern models of fridges and freezers um, which makes it a lot easier because trying to clean them while they're in the back of the fridge um, is pretty impossible to be honest. So I'll just go ahead and show you that now guys. So on most of them underneath is a clip that holds it onto the top of the compressor. Some of the older ones will have um, pipe work actually inside the, the drip tray, so them ones, the chances are you won't be able to remove them. Um, but like I say, most modern ones now you can. So to get them out, on the bottom underneath, there'll be some um, like glue, like a tarry glue that holds them into place. And also there's a clip underneath and to get them off, you need to pull them quite hard. You have to apply quite a lot of force to get them out. And then underneath is just a clip, but the clips together with the glue holds it into place really well. So yeah, I just thought that might help someone out. It's, um, it can be a pain cleaning these. If you ever walk into your building and, and there's a foul smell, um, there's a very good chance it can be these uh, drip trays in the back of your fridge. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope you found this helpful. Please like and subscribe if you did. We've got loads of helpful videos on the channel and loads of reviews on products. Alright guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.